and so be it. In Jesus' name. Tell him thank you. Have a
get so futuristic. Until we forget about what's going on now. Sometimes we can get ahead of ourselves. I know more than you can shoot. But the isness of God keeps you from that foolishness. You learn how to praise God the way He gets you already. <laughs>
He didn't bring you this far.
Give ear unto me, O my nation, for the law shall proceed from me, and I will make my judgment to rest the light of the people. Remembering the wrong. some drops, even me. But the awesomeness of God wishes to saturate. It is God's design to saturate our lives with his presence. He wants to. Not only Bless us, 
externally and give us stuff. Stuff will come. But to enjoy his presence. Yeah. Look at the law. Father Abraham, the scripture says, and Sarah, your mama. He was but one, and I called him, and I blessed him, and increased him, even so the eternal counsel of Zion. He's talking about the nations of, of Israel, Judah. Started from there, I want all my people to be blessed. But this is the rock. He was saying to them, as he is to us. This is the rock from which you were dug. Consider. his commitment. For he said in verse 16, and men verily swear by the greater. And an oath for confirmation is to them an end of all strife. So the Lord swearing 
by himself. Hallelujah. It's a good thing for which God will do to get us to see that I'm for you. I'm all about you. I'm going to get it fixed for you. It's already fixed, in other words. You can rely upon me. You can rely upon me. I'm going to hold on to this rock. Glory to God. He said, Where well, is God willing more abundantly to show unto the heirs of promise the immutability of the council confirmed it by an oath? God confirmed it by an oath. He swore by himself and by two immutable things in which it was impossible for God to lie. Shout hallelujah now. Simply want us to remember the rock from which we were healed. Thank God for the opportunity to be a part of the rock of which God chose as one alone and made it great. Thank God for the rock. Thank God I remember the rock. We become children of Abraham by faith. We believe God. We believe that he swore by himself. Verse 19 says, Which hope we have as an anchor of the soul, both sure and steadfast, and which enters into that within the veil. Thank you, Jesus, in the veil. In the veil. Thank you for the veil. The veil was ripped from top to bottom. Gave us access, gave us entrance in to the Holy of Holies. Well, the forerunner is for us entered, even Jesus Christ, made a high priest forever after the old of Manchester. The Lord said to us in Galatians 3 and 6, when he said that even as Abraham believed God, even as he believed God, and it was counted to him for righteousness, remembering the rock. If you want to be right, believe God. Know ye therefore that they which are of faith, the same are the children of Abraham, remembering the rock. The rock from which we were healed. The rock from which God blessed the nations of Israel when he has sent out promises as a result of what our lives shall ultimately be. We shall be eternally with him. He has given us life starting with the rock because he believed God and God made him great made him a blessing and everyone who cursed him got to watch how, what you say about the children of Abraham don't undermine them because God knows the heart, doesn't he? Yes. 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 Foreseeing that God was justified the heathens through faith, you can be in the God of it. God will bring you out by faith. Amen. All God needs for you to believe yes. that Jesus Christ is Lord. He is Savior. He is the only one that can deliver you from your sins. Yes. Yes. Preach before the gospel unto Abraham, saying in thee 
shall all nations be blessed. And the ninth verse says, so then, they which be of faith are blessed with faithful Abraham. When I believe God, you can rest assured that it came from the rock. Because Abraham believed God. And when you believe God, the way that Abraham did, we will be blessed yes. like Abraham was. Yes. Give him some praise in that. We are, we are the children of Abraham by faith. We are blessed by God. Having faith in Jesus Christ that came from the rock of which we have been charged to remember from where we were dug. And the final verse I wish to shall we use Romans 4, verse 17. As it is written, I have made thee a father of many nations. Abraham became my father according to scripture by faith. I have made thee a father of many nations. Before him whom he believed even God who quickens the dead and calleth those things which be not as though they were. God is interested in showing us that if you can believe me, he has examples for us to follow. And he started with the rock and he declared the rock to be Abraham and Sarah. We don't like the old time stuff, but unless you stay with the old time stuff. I don't care if it's the 29th century. God isn't going to change because you want to jazz up stuff. God does not change. He said, I'm God and I change not. I'm glad that he's my Lord. Glad that he's my Savior. And as he was with Abraham, so shall he be with you and me. And no valley is too deep that he will not see you through. No mountain is too high that he wouldn't give you victory over it. So I say to you in Jesus' name, remember the rock. I said remember the rock. From whence he was you. Maybe a small thing, but you came out with a rock. That he was that God Almighty blessed the whole world and the nations. The rock from whence you were dead. That song. They do something like this, but I got up. I got up. My old grandson is singing to me. He got out. I wonder what the world is. <laughs>
it is one transitioning from one to the next. So now we have the great I am through the rock. The promise that God gave was the Lord Jesus Christ through Abraham. And I guess you say, how could that be? God had to have a man who could redeem the world. And he came through generations, yes. 40 and four generations, oh, finally got to the one that had Emmanuel in it. Yes. By being interpreted, yes. God with us. Yes. But he came from the rock. Yes. Remember, the rock. Yeah. Give him some praise in the house. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yes, sir. Uh, the rock was kind of small. I was looking for a bigger rock. <laughs> but I guess the size of the rock wouldn't matter. Uh, it was a lot. So I say to you, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, let us remember the awesomeness of God. Where you pick out a believer, you pick out somebody who would say, Amen. I guess you say that he must have had a pretty bad family. We all got bad families. Dysfunctional. Until we realize how much I need God. Praise God. Hallelujah. We'll miss the blessings of God. Of course, Abraham did not completely follow God as he had given directions. But it finally happened when he just separated himself from Lot. And he was able to look up to heaven and see. The Lord took him off of probation. He had him on probation because he knew what he was going to do when you obey me fully. Yes. You can't count the blessings that I'm going to see. Somehow or the other, I believe that I was in the number. Somehow or the other, I believe that when Abraham obeyed God, the numbers that he could not count Somehow was in there. Somehow I got in there. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. For Abraham to become my father by faith, somehow I got in there when he pulled that knife back to slay his only son. He had Israel, but the Lord discounted him because he operated outside of his will. And when he obeyed God fully, then the Lord said, now, you fear me. And he stayed in the hand of Abraham. Abraham wasn't but in claim, he was fixing to kill his own son. Do you hear me say? He was fixing to slay his son. He drew back the knife, but he 
prepare the voice from heaven. Do that, son, no harm. Can you imagine that? Remember the rock. Oh, praise God. Oh, God, I think that's given some praise in the house. Hallelujah. Lord, we give you glory. Lord, we give you praise. Lord, we give you glory. Lord, we give you praise. We magnify you. We worship you. We praise you for who you are. Being our God, being our Savior, being our Keeper, reminding us of this, the depths of your love and how far you have gone to assure it, guarantee it. Father, in the name of your Son, I want to thank you for your love, your mercy, your grace. Thank you for your holy presence in our lives, leading and directing our steps as we go. Thank you, Jesus Christ, for your healing virtue. Thank you for this great salvation. You've spoken miracles into our lives. Help us to trust you rely fully upon you because we have submitted our all to you we are no longer our own but we are both of the Christ have thine way Lord have thine way in our if you have thine way we'll give you praise even when it hurts even when it's not pleasant, we'll give you praise. We'll give you praise because you always know what's best. Thank you, God, for being such a good God. Good God. Thank you, Lord. We ask you to bless everyone. We believe, lean, and depend on you, knowing that you're able to keep us from falling. Help us to have faith and remember the rock from which we were here. In Jesus' name we pray. And until next time, may God richly bless you. It's my prayer. Hallelujah. Is there someone here today who to get connected with the rock if you're not. Today is your day. Through the baptism of the Holy Ghost, baptism in Jesus' name, you can start on your way. And it's simply by obeying and trusting and believing God is what make it all happen. You, you can't enjoy Jesus without faith. You, even, you cannot come to him without faith. You're going to have to believe God. And Abraham believed God. It was counted to him for righteousness. It doesn't matter how bad you are. If you believe God, he'll turn that situation around. Where you was heathenistic and ugly, cool tricks on folks, not satisfying until you have your way. The Lord said, I'm sweet, man. Just believe on Jesus Christ. And he will turn your life around. So come on down and receive prayer. The hours on the outside, you may come. And you can return in the center hour. Remember, you, you can put it off too long. So why don't you say to the Lord today?
सईद मारे आप सुनने इच्छा न आवाज से ये बीच में कंजीवन स्पीड अभी चले ये बीच को लौट चले टच यू अगेन वर्म ना एवरीथिंग प्रेयर 